Hello there, World of Tankers. Welcome to the channel. Hopefully all of you are doing well out there. Now, about a week ago, I had a discussion on my community tab where you guys, whoever the most liked comment was, I would make a video on it. Now, the most liked was pole dancing with droodles. And as much as I would love to do that, unless I make an OnlyFans anytime soon, the next best one was starting a free-to-play account, which I thought was actually a pretty cool idea because not only do I get to suffer without caring too much about my stats on a secondary account, but as well... I get to see what the grind is like for any newer player coming into the game, dealing with stock tanks, trying to upgrade them, and all these other things coming into the game without spending a single nick of money. That is the whole challenge. I'm not allowed to spend any money on this account. So that's exactly what we're going to be doing, is not spending money. So I got a couple choices here of vehicles I can grind for. Germany, USSR, UK. There's, there's so many different uh, nations right now that you can go for. And I'm very tempted to go for the European nation because of of course, I love the Progetto 65, but really what I'm thinking is I'm going to go, uh, you know what? Yeah, we're going to go for it. We're going to go for the, I don't want to go for the Progetto. I want to go for the Kronwagen. So we play on keyboard and mouse. Here we go. Proving grounds. The aiming circle shows the area in which your shell hits. Yes, I, I would have to guess that. Welcome to the training camp. Here you will learn the basics of battle. Oh yeah, you use your mouse to move the camera. Look at this. I'm learning camera. Am I allowed to move? Oh, look at the bunker. Okay. And look at the truck. Ah, oh, skill. Look at that. I'm already better than 80% of most World of Tanks players. Now we can drive. That's pretty cool. It'd be kind of cool if they had, like, the WASD thing at the bottom as it was when you played the game. That'd be really cool. I, I kind of like to see that. But, yeah, yeah, let's make our way over here. Yes. Oh, can we, can we move? Oh, yeah, look at that. Look at the speed. It's immense. <laughs> this is not the prettiest of takes. Let me know in the comments down below, where very old calls like this, I'm pretty sure this is some sort of Vickers type tank, were these World War I or World War II tanks? Because they look like just, if they were World War II, like the early, early, early stages. But let's, uh, let's skill this guy out of existence. You can't beat Mo. He doesn't even, he doesn't even, okay. I wonder if he continues to shoot. Oh, oh, you're gonna get me. Oh, you're gonna get me. I wonder if he pens the side of me. Oh, he does. Oh, he's shooting HE. That's why, okay, I see. That's what the whole big brain point of this is. So he's not even supposed to damage you. You know what? Take this, loser. Oh, yeah. Enemy skill. Look at this. I'm going to destroy these crates. This is what I'm doing in Blitz lately. Everybody asks me what I've been doing in the Blitz for the last couple of years. This is what I've really been doing is playing in the Proving Grounds. All right. So what do we got over here? This is, I guess, the only map that they really haven't updated the graphics on since it first came into the game. To make a more accurate shot, switch to sniper mode. Like, you can see the graphics on the Proving Grounds are definitely, uh, yeah, they're a little, she's a little old. But you know what? It's, it's fine. Look at this. We're gonna, we're gonna penetrate the enemy. We're gonna cheat. Ha ha. Ah ha ha. This game thought it could outsmart me by not being able to penetrate you. Oh, dang it. The front of the tank is the thickest armor you were beholden. Now, you see, the issue with this, and this is one thing I talked about on one of my tutorial videos, is that when you have the thick of the, the front of, t of the tank only having the thickest armor saying that, it's kind of incorrect because, of course, there are weak spots like the cupola on the roof that I've shot twice. There's also some tanks, let's say like the Amex, uh, uh, <laughs> we killed him. Wait, 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 guys, we gotta get him. We gotta get him from the side. Sorry, I need to, uh... Need to make my way over here and take him out from the side, you know, they get the skill. Here we go. Uh, oh, I got him. Oh, it missed. All right. So it wants us to probably use auto aim, but uh, let's aim in on the enemy and uh, aim in these precise shots. Yeet. Look at this. The skill. You see, if any person in the tutorial does this easy, then they'd probably be fine at blitz. Yeah, there's a couple things that you need to know but the sad thing is is that a lot of people i feel take like actual misses on the tutorial like that but there you go we have completed the mighty tutorial and uh wow that actually counts as a wall 45 xp woo that is not any xp to be fair okay we get five gold for, yeah you know we actually get gold okay next all right research yep uh, we can't research that. Next, uh, you need more combat XP to research this module. Join battles. Battle. Oh, yeah, we get 10 gold. So, are these actual players, or are they... Well, we can check if they're actual players by after the game. We can go and take a look. I think the only real players would be player 6... Actually, I'm not sure. We are in the, the RU server for this account, which means that there's probably a lot more people playing. So, I'm not sure if there's actually a lot of newer players. Or just not. So we're going to have to find out because I would really like to know. But a good way to tell is if we die. Because what I want to do 
is we are going to YOLO straight into the middle, and we're going to survive, because that is skill. You ready? Oh, you know what? Could we capture the base? That would be the most skill, is capturing the base. Here we go. Oh, take this. Oh, that was bad. Capturing the base. You can't get me. You cannot outskill me. Nasty fox, get out of here. See, this is the part I don't understand. I don't believe that anybody's this bad at the game. Like, yeah, what? I just don't believe this. It doesn't look right to have people this bad at the game. But, uh, you know what? Take this. Oh. Oh. That, that was a bit of a shame. Let's try again. Uh... Uh, take this! Man, this thing's got a long reload for only 30 damage. That's a, that's a pain. But, like, I, I still can't believe that there's people... Where that? Auto-aim? Huh? Yeah, thank you, auto-aim. But, like, there's no way this guy's real. It's just not possible. Like, what does he do? He literally sat there, stares at me for 10 seconds. What is this guy doing? I, I honestly think that most of the people are just AIs they put in here so that you shoot at something. But I, it would be nice if they had real people. I guess the issue is they don't have enough new people joining the game. So, let's see. Let's aim it on this guy. Like, I've made four accounts personally because I've got one on EU, one on Asia, one on NA now. And I've also got one on... I've got two on RU, actually. Okay, auto-aim. Auto-aim sucks. If you'll ever notice this, a lot of people always say PC auto-aim is, uh, is better than mobile. Because mobile auto-aim doesn't auto-aim like that. Well, you'll notice that PC auto-aim... That's where it's aiming right now. It's aiming at the bunker. PC auto-aim is very bad, in my personal opinion, because it doesn't aim at the center mass sometimes. It just kind of sucks. So, let's clear this guy. Look at that. Four. Four kills. The skill of the mighty Vickers MKF. So, that was a pretty decent battle, I guess. I'm not sure. Oh, it doesn't let us check. I would have loved to have seen if the people were... Uh, maybe we can take a look at... No, I don't want to... No, 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 no. I don't want to skip the tutorial. Holy moly. That's a lot more people. 45,000 people on the current RU server. That's like how many are maxed on the NA. That's a lot. Okay, here we go. The next one. We got... Uh, different names all around yeah so these gotta be bots there's no way they've got 50 people joining oh well let's see what we can do here if they're not bots i'll be so extremely impressed but uh we'll see we will see this time i'm gonna do even a step further i'm going to drive into their spawn directly that way this skill will be unreal here we go aim in and fire oh oh this gun's not very accurate on the move but I'm going to drive literally straight. Oh, oh, you hit me. Oh, you got me. Oh, gee, you took two off me. The skill of this guy is unreal. Here we go. Auto aim and boop. Yes. You can't catch me. Like, what is this? These bots, uh, well, even if they are real players, they're obviously bots. Like, there's no way. These are the work. H-E, yeah. Okay, okay. Now, here's something I'd like to point out to you. This is how you know they're bots. At tier 2 and tier 1, HE shells were removed from the game. You saw that was an HE because it did that damage. HE shells were removed from the game. You can see I've only got one type of shell currently, which shows you that this is actually just bots because they haven't bothered to remove the HE shells from the bots yet from the game. So, yeah, don't you love that? So, there you go. That was our second battle. 167 damage. I guess driving into the enemy works even better. Still can't check the battle results, so that kind of sucks. You need 110 more XP to research. Enter a battle to earn combat XP. Wow, this is uh, this is where I've said the game gets quite boring. This is the issue with the free-to-play, is that it gets very boring after a while when you keep doing this. It's just the same thing over and over and over. And this doesn't really help anybody get better. And at least only I'm getting some gold every now and then. That's nice. And I might have to watch those ads every day to get even more gold. But the issue is, it's really not... Um, it's just not that exciting, I guess, to keep battling like this, especially for a newer player. It's probably, you get to the third battle, you'd be like, oh, is this all the game is? Then you'd probably stop, because this is not the most fun. Okay, that is the same M2 Lite, because that is the exact same thing that the last M2 Lite did. So, they also have the pre- okay, so I guess it's literally just bots that go to the exact same spot every single time. You know what? You know what? Take this. Take this. Kill me. I want to die. I actually want to die this time. Kill me. Kill me. Oh. Okay, I see how it is. Boop! Alright, you're not gonna shoot me, I'm gonna guess. You're just gonna sit here and stare at me. Yep. Okay, and we're gonna hit this guy on the move, because we're skill. Imagine if this is how all games battled. I could have a 100% win rate. What if we try to get a 100% win rate on this account with one vehicle? I'll just play one battle. But, uh, well, let's finish off this guy, because we're gonna high roll him, obviously. And let's go over here and finish off the Panzer... To the Panzer II. Yeah, I guess that's it. I was trying to think of a... Yeah, I guess it's just the Panzer II, you really call it. Oh, you got me! Oh, you took off like 10 hit points there. I was so worried. 
So, yeah, that was it. Oh, my FPS just absolutely dropped there for some reason, but pretty good. Wow, we did a uh, 284 damage. Do we get to research our modules? Oh, research a tier two. Oh boy, purchase. You know what? The tier two actually looks really nice. I'm surprised. It looks. Pre oh my god, now we gotta fight a battle on a tier two. Uh, oh, we're actually on a, a normal map, though, so we'll have to see. So, I do know one person that's real is the Avi guy, because he's actually got an actual avatar. You probably have to be real to have an avatar, so that's one thing I will say. We are driving a stock Tier 2, um, which is... it's great. It actually looks pretty cool, though. I do like that they've made a lot of the Tier 2s and Tier 3s have a bunch of striping and stuff. But here's a good question. Why don't the Tier 10s have a bunch of cool striping? That doesn't make sense at all to me. Like, why can't a tier 10 have a cool bear on the side of it and, you know, stuff like that? But, oh, well. Not stuff I will question uh, Wargaming, please. Don't question Wargaming for 500, Alex. So, let's just make our way. This thing's actually got decent gun depression, I guess. I don't know. It's kind of ugly at the same time it looks cool. But we're just going to make our way right up the hill and take this. Yeah, that's right. 44 damage. Get out of here. Oh, this guy. He's a... Oh, oh yeah. Look at that penetration he's got. The D2. The D2 usually actually is good pen, which is quite... Uh, see, this guy doesn't seem awful. He actually doesn't seem like he's bad at the game. Unless it's just a re-roll, which then kind of sucks. I wonder where he bounced me. Oh, I don't have the markers on, I bet. Why? Why Why do you do this? Why? Even... Oh, no, no. Even at tier 2, you still got people that block you. Uh, actually, I do have the markers on. I can see rebounds. He's right on the side. Okay. All right. Let's, uh, let's keep aiming in on this guy. I like how we can barely even pen a tier 3 that's got, like, no armor. Uh, you know what? We've got a body shield. It's fine. We've got, uh, armor here. This guy, yeah, he's gonna die. It's fine. This guy's actually a really tricky pen as well. Let's start aiming for this guy. Maybe we can master this vehicle. <laughs> let's just keep on aiming. Oh, no, no. Oh, my God. This butt. Stay, stay away. I don't like you. This guy is a butt. What I find funny is I was pretty sure the D... Oh, my... Oh, and then he stops. You butt. You absolute butt. Even at tier two. I see how it is. Okay, let's keep aiming here. Keep on getting these shells out. We are we are racking up the damage here. Look at that. 403 damage. That's more than what Sad is averaging at, like, some tier 8 players average. But, uh, well, you know what? Let's keep going here. Boom! Take that! 46 damage. Get on my skill level. I don't even care if my teammates die, because I want to get the damage. I wonder where that... Oh, there's the Panzer 30. I think that guy's the real player. Is that the guy with the avatar? I think it is, right? Uh, it is the Panzer, but, uh, not much he can do to me. He's gonna get taken out by the mighty, mighty Droodles. Yes, take that, and then we keep on aiming, and we keep on going for him. Take that, yes. Okay, we're actually doing decent, to be honest, which is surprising. Let's keep on going here. Oh, oh, that bounced. You know what? He bounced to me, and we're gonna ram him, take off a nice 34. You know, I'm surprised we took less off of him than we took off ourselves, because that doesn't make sense at all, but keep on damaging him. That person shot me up the butt, but little does he know, he's about to die. You know what? It's going to take one more shell, which kind of sucks, but the circle of death is real. And there you go, taken out. So, you know what? I'm just skilled. That's all it is. It is so much skill to play in a tier, uh, a tier 2 game, isn't it? So all we got left is the Chiha and the BT-7. We've already done, what, like 900 damage, which is kind of funny. We're just, yeah, 884 damage. Drive over the hill here, ram this guy. There's still three tanks left, to be honest. 64 there, or whatever, I'll take it. Keep on racking out the damage. Don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. Oh, never mind. Oh, he did hit. I'll give him credit. Oh, gee, wait, I don't want to get hit anymore. This isn't good. My team is actually throwing. They're throwing quite quickly. Damage, damage. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Now we gotta, uh, we gotta not get hit by a bot. Good, okay. And keep on going. We're doing our job here, but, uh, oh, oh, wait. We gotta finish off this guy in the back first. All right, no, no, no. Uh oh, uh oh, I don't like this. Uh, yeah, let's just let's just shoot this guy. I think we got we got enough health to take him out. He's bouncing us. The skill is unreal. Look at this. We are we are beating everybody right now. You can't beat me. Oh, one health. Yeah, I steal that kill. That's right. We're gonna get five kills. We're gonna get a what what is it? A pools? No, pools is six. Is it a Radley? I think it's a Radley Walters. If you get five, look at that. Five kills, over a thousand damage. This skill. That's actually sad. That we had just averaged more in the single game. 1,236 damage in a tier 6. Or yes, a tier 6. That would have been actually decent for a tier 6. But no, that's... <laughs> Alright, let's see. Are these people actually real? Nope, that's a fake player. That's not a new player. That's not a new player. That's not a new player. Not a new player. And not a new player. So the way you can tell if they're not real people is because you can see how the Nate, or the people have zero battles. It's not possible. As you can see, I have one battle. You have to have at least one battle if you are on an actual battle. So this guy here, he's got real games. But this guy, fake, 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 fake. So that's just how little people are joining the game currently. All of those are bots. So 
Uh, select uh, one of the nations. I don't want to select one of the nations, though. Okay, cool. Yeah, uh-huh. Tank destroyers. Oh, wait. They probably wanted to show heavies and stuff as well. Purchase. I didn't want to go to the... No, I don't want to do the Jap... Fine, I'll do the Japanese. Congratulations, you completed basic tutorial. I'm ready to go play tier 10 and buy one now. So... Yeah, this was the tutorial for World of Tanks Blitz. If you want to see me continue the battles, of course, please let me know any comments down below. But that's exactly what we're going to be doing. I'm going to be making my way all the way down this line to hopefully get to the Kronwagen. So let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Hopefully you enjoyed today's video. But other than that, hopefully all of you are doing well out there. Stay happy, stay healthy, and to be seeing you in the next one.